Hello fellow YouTubers and welcome back to Road to 100,000. So, last week didn't exactly have the best week. Only 205 points last week, which is, you know, respectable if you're not trying to reach 100,000 points by June 15th, 2015. But since I am, and I am already way behind the pace, <laughs> I needed to kick it up for this week. Did I? Uh, <laughs> well, no. <laughs> In fact, I, I, uh, well, let's just, let's just jump into the games first off. So the first game we started off with was Halo the Master Chief Collection because last week I had gotten an achievement, I had gotten an achievement before recording last week's episode, but since it was part of this week anyway, didn't count it towards last week. Instead, I uh, got six achievements in that game worth 60 points. Yeah, I got the one one achievement I mentioned. The achievement that I basically was getting during the process of last episode's, like, what you can see in last episode, which was trying to hey, speed, th speed run through the level of assaults in the control room, which I actually did, like I said. Yeah, I said that. Yeah. But I uh, f finally, those... Those achievements that I, I got all the way back on like the first couple days, like a, a month ago, finally finally act unlocked and gave me points. So that's <laughs> that's actually where most of the points for Halo came from. Just those four achievements. So they're on the list. Technically, they said they were like unlocked between November 22nd and November 29th, which would <laughs> just cut, make the cutoff of last week, or would have made the cutoff of last week. Would made the cutoff of week nine. Uh, but they but they finally popped this week and so we got the points for those and the uh, so that brings our weekly total up to 60 points and our gamer score total up to 67,750 so <laughs> slowly but surely we're getting close to 70,000 I mean technically we should have hit 70,000 already if we want to get on pace in fact we're probably getting close to the point where we need to hit 80,000 <laughs> but the next game we played was... Uh, oh, I wrote The Walking Dead here. That is not right. It is The Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion. Now, I have perfected The Elder Scrolls V. I have spent maybe 300 plus hours on The Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Uh, Oblivion? Um... Not, not as long? <laughs> In fact, the only reason I'm really playing Oblivion is to A... Um get the achievements because <laughs> I know that the, the the achievements in Oblivion are a lot easier than the achievements in Skyrim but they do take a long time I think I've played the Oblivion for about 40 hours now and I'm getting close to the end of all the achievements basically especially since they're so easy to do we got nine achievements in the Elder Scrolls for Oblivion <laughs> uh, worth 130 gamer score get bringing our weekly total up to 190 and our grand total up to 67,880 and that's where we stopped <laughs> that's as far as I got I mean for the Elder Scrolls I basically had to finish the the fighters guild I only had to finish the fighters guild mission and so I got the achievement for that and then I started going through the mages guild uh, almost got done with the mages guild but was like about an hour away from finishing it off but then 12 o'clock hit last night I did finish it today though so th that achievement will be certainly on next week <laughs> but yeah 190 points this week that's worse than last week <laughs> I think I think it's because I only really played four achievements or at least trying to get achievements over the weekend <laughs> like I only really played for a couple hours on Friday a couple hours last Sunday and a couple hours m the majority of Saturday yesterday uh, going for this stuff because well I, I decided to work overtime uh, this week so I could get some extra Christmas cash and I'm gonna be working I'm pretty much gonna be working overtime until the end of the year just so I can get some extra cash for that so <laughs> my my numbers are going to drop if I make a I should make a graph just to show how my weekly how how much my weekly increase has been every week and these last two are just not good. <laughs> like the lowest I ever had before these weeks were around the 350 mark, which is still respectable, but not a lot compared when you're trying to beat a, trying to beat something. Why can't I have like a week where I get 1675 points again? Granted, I had what a CSI game plus parts of a Lego game. 
I didn't really ex I don't really expect to get those numbers again unless something crazy happens. What week was that? No, oh, that was a uh, yeah, that was that was week 3, wasn't it? With Sonic and Ground Zeroes and The Walking Dead and NCIS. That's four games right there. I don't play two this week. Uh, just well, let's see. Just looking at the games I have scattered around my desk that I could get achievements in. Obviously, Oblivion. I'm I'm almost halfway done with that. I still have to go. I'm starting the Thieves Guild right now. Then I have the Dark Brotherhood after that. Then I still have the main quest, and it's the Game of the Year edition. Well, at least I have a copy of the Game of the Year edition, so I can get all the achievements in the DLC as well. So that's what five. That's that's. What did I just say? Thieves, Dark, Main. Well, that's, four, that's four different quest lines I can finish, which should be fairly quick to do, roughly, as long as I'm following walkthroughs. And not to mention, I still have, whoa, still have The Walking Dead. Almost dropped, I picked it up and almost dropped it. The Walking Dead to finish. I'm almost, I'm about halfway done through seats, through uh, episode three, and then I need to start playing through season two. I, surprisingly, I've managed to keep myself completely unspoiled for season two, which is great, wonderful, absolutely wonderful. And then there's that other game that I keep on talking about that I can now get a very easy achievement in because I have two Xbox One controllers. But I decided to go for the harder ones first, and they're taking way too long! And then the new Gamefly game I got, which... I haven't even touched. <laughs> oh well, I just found out I got the 26th off of work, because it's now considered a federal holiday, so... Yay! Although, although technically, I plan on spending that day recording a lot of episodes for Watch Me Fail and Legacy, because I need to get a backlog created so I could actually start using this time to get achievements. That's my problem. I don't, I don't have a backlog anymore, and so all my free time is basically going to creating episodes of Watch Me Fail and Legacy. Oh well, I'll do better. <laughs> oh, and then I did, I did something else that I'll be talking about next week. That'll certainly not help this at all but now that now that the Xbox now that the Halo achievement started popping I, I feel more confident in starting to play that in fact you probably just saw me play a couple of multiplayer games on the screen during that time what did I record for Oblivion I can't I can't remember what I did and that was that was earlier this morning oh you know, whatever so percentage wise well, we kind of already know I mean we only we uh we went from 32.40 to 32.4 percent towards our goal to 32.8 percent, giving us a grand increase of 0.4 percent, which is not good, especially when the weekly upgrade is 1.94 percent every week. Next week we will be hitting the the halfway point. We'll we'll, we'll we will go over 50 percent during the course of this week. And we are not even close to 40% of our goal. Eh. But I, like I said, we just need to hit 99,000. 99,000 because of that one game I have that, that'll be absolutely perfect to get the 10,000th point on. 100,000th point on. So as soon as we hit 90,000, or 99,000, we'll have made it. <laughs> as long as we can hit that before June, everything should be fine. But, <laughs> next week should be uh, hopefully better. I mean, now I'm going through Oblivion. That should take a little bit. That should be quicker than normal. I already have, like, 50 points towards next week, so that's good. I'm already, I'm already a fourth of the way to this week, and I haven't even technically started. <laughs> so, until next week, hopefully you enjoy.